Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're having a wonderful day and that you are doing well. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing an updated look at my Stackers Jewelry Box. If you recall, I actually do have another video where I was sharing like a really good in-depth look at my Stackers Jewelry Box, the different layers I have of it, and how I first initially organized it. But since that video, I've gone back and I've actually reorganized it. So I kind of wanted to share with you what I've done, how I reorganized it, what Pandora pieces I have in here. So basically in all the layers, I have majority of it is part of my Pandora collection, but I also have some ogre beads and a couple other things that I'm excited to share with you. So if you are ready to see an updated look at my Stacker's Jewelry Box, make sure to grab a delicious cup of tea. So I'm enjoying some pumpkin pie matcha from David's Tea. I made this with almond milk and you guys, it is so good. If you wanna try it, I will have an affiliate link down below in the description bar of this video. Anyway, you guys, without further ado, let's get started. I have the classic Stackers jewelry box with four different layers. It is done in the blush and has beautiful rose gold detailing and accents. Now, if you're curious about Stackers and where to find them, I actually received the Stackers jewelry box from That Diamond Girl. They have beautiful jewelry items, but they also carry a wide variety of Stackers jewelry boxes, including charm specific pieces like the charm bars and other special layers that you can organize your charm bracelets with. Now they are actually now offering free shipping on orders over 150, which means that if you're in North America, you can actually receive free shipping on your items. If you're outside of North America, they do have worldwide shipping. So no matter where you are in the world, you can order directly from that diamond girl to get your stackers jewelry box pieces. They were also kind enough to give me a 15% discount code for you guys on your jewelry box orders. So if you use the code EMILY15, it will save you 15% off your jewelry box order. I do receive a small commission off each sale. So thank you so much if you do use my code. It really does help me out a lot. The jewelry box layer that you're seeing here is called the Stackers Charm Jewelry Box Lid in the blush color. And I decided to use this to organize all my Pandora Rose jewelry. So in here, you'll see my different bracelets. You'll see the charms. In the middle section, I have my Pandora O pendants which have a little lit, like little light accents of Pandora Rose on them. You can see a little sneak peek here. I also have my Pandora Rose rings in there. I'm thinking over time I might want to get a layer to keep my rings in separately but for now this works really well because it's really great to see what I have because I often like to use my rings like my rose rings to match with my rose bracelets and things so it's really nice to see like everything displayed it's well organized I see what I have what I'm working with now here you also see a little close-up of the different bracelets I have so I have my winter theme bracelets kind of winter romance theme is what I call it and underneath it here I actually have my Enchanted Forest bracelet. Now you might remember that the clasp had broken, but I was able to get it fixed and repaired. So I'm so happy about that. Now I, all I need really to get for it is a Pandora safety chain, which I'm hoping to do one that has some Pandora rose in it, whether it's an accident or a full Pandora rose safety chain piece. So that's a look at the bracelets. And I really love these little bracelet sections for them. It's so nice to see them displayed. And here's a quick look at the charm bar that comes with it. So as you can see I also do have some non Pandora rose jewelry here but they're often pieces I like to style with Pandora rose so I keep them on here and I love this little rod it's so functional it's a great way to see your charms and also design with so if I'm thinking of playing around or breaking up a design I can keep these charms on here or create the design itself like a little mini design so I really love that feature of this jewelry box now down below I have a lot of extra bracelets which this section is technically you can put your charm here. I also have added some clips here, Pandora clips. I have some earrings here as well as a pendant, but you can in fact just put some charms here and see them nicely displayed. But as you can see, I decided to use that extra space for my Pandora rose theme bracelet. So you can see I have Pandora reflections, some moments bracelets. I have the Pandora T-bar bracelet in here. So quite a lot. And what I'm hoping to do over time is to add another six piece bracelet layer. You're actually going to see what that looks like a little bit later. I already have a layer of that, but I was thinking about getting an extra one for my Pandora rose bracelets jewelry right here. So I think it'd just be helpful because then I can use the space for what it's intended for. But for now, I just chose to keep my 
Pandora bracelets as is. But here's, you can see here on the screen, I have the six piece layer right there. So it's a great way to display your extra Pandora pieces. But here you can see I have my Pandora tea party theme bracelet. I have my butterfly garden. And then here's a quick look at the reflections bracelet. They're so, so pretty. So that's basically a look at that first layer. Now I'm gonna share with you how I decided to organize the second layer, which is kind of like a Disney star theme layer. And I'm like, I'm obsessed with how this turned out. I really love how it looks. Now I do have some of the pieces I usually store in here on. So the rings I keep in actually these sections here that you're seeing. So some of the items are missing because I'm wearing them, but Overall, it's like kind of like a Starry Night Disney magic theme. So I have my When You Wish Upon a Star bracelet in here. I have another two-tone Disney bracelet I'm working on, as well as some extra charms that I'm currently not wearing that are Disney inspired or more of a star theme. So you can see I have some Muranos here. I, I did buy an extra Pandora 20 star charm. So I wanted to add that in here because it's kind of like little mini designs. And these are items that I often wear on a Pandora O pendant. So I've just put them up here kind of separate because I think they look cute on the Pandora O pendant. So really love these charm bar layers. By the way, the little charm bars, they have a size small and a large size. I actually will leave links down below so you guys can quickly find these items if you're curious about them, but they're so great for organizing and designing with. Now here you can also see I have sections for different pieces. So I have my beautiful Pandora necklaces stored in here. So I love, I love this piece. So I have the necklace, Heart of Winter, the pendant and the earrings here. I also do have the ring, but I put it into a different section. And yeah, I'm just loving how this looks. I also have this beautiful necklace that Carla got me. I'm actually wearing it as I'm doing this voiceover, which is really cool. I have an extra Pandora reflection star clip in here. Here's a beautiful Pandora ring. So I just love these little sections for storing items. They look so pretty. And again, it's just so easy to find everything. So moving on to the next layer, this is the six piece layer. And I love it, you guys. It's so beautifully stored. Like, and when you open it up, you can see all the different items that you're working with, your different themes. So. For this layer, I decided to use it for more of my holiday kind of themed bracelets. So I have, well, this one's not technically holiday, but it's my frozen theme bracelet that I'm currently working on. It's still not quite finished, but I'm really happy with how it looks. So here's a little quick look at it on the Pandora T-Bar bracelet. And then above it, I do have a Disney Christmas theme, which again, is still not 100%. I'm probably gonna play around with it closer to Christmas. I also do have my Christmas Moments bracelet, which you're seeing there. And below it, I have my Snow White theme bracelet, which I tend to love to wear during the autumn season, especially in Halloween. This is an updated design. So if you'd like to see a video on it, please let me know down below. Now you might be noticing the empty space right here and that's actually for my Halloween theme bracelet. While I was filming this part of the video, I actually had it on my wrist. So here's a quick look at it. I'm really loving how it turned out. And here's a look at it inside the jewelry box. Now, if you follow me on Instagram at Fashion Storyteller, you will know that I actually have since updated this design with the new pumpkin Mickey charm. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's the cutest charm. If you do wanna see it, I'll leave a link down below or you can follow me on my Instagram account. I've been taking lots of videos of my Halloween bracelet. I love how it turned out. Now this last layer is called the necklace layer and inside it I have a variety of different charm bars and you can see here I have all my ogre beads and look how amazing it is to like look at your glass beads see them all, see what you're working with. On this last bar here, I actually have all of my extra Pandora charms that I'm not currently design, designing with I should say but a lot of them are more like holiday theme. So I have all my Valentine's Day charms that I like to use there. I have some St. Patrick's Day charms here. And then I've again, here is all my ogre beads and these little rods come out and the sides screw off. If you do want to see a little closer look at this, I do have my other stackers video where I'll show a little more up close look at the function of each of the layers and the different like options that they have. But Oh my gosh, I love it. So basically that is a look at how I redesigned my stacker's jewelry box, kind of reorganized it. And I'm really happy with how it's turned out. It's so easy to find the pieces I'm looking for. I know which layer has what type of jewelry inside. And I really love my Disney kind of starry theme layer. Like I love how it's themed out. It almost feels like you're going to a store and like shopping when you see everything so beautifully displayed. 
Anyway, you guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed seeing an updated look at my Stackers Jewelry Box, as well as kind of a little look at my Pandora collection. I wish you a wonderful, magical rest of your day. Stay safe, take care, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.